from time to time I make a video called for blacks. I am specifying this video for black men because the particular thing in question is to give you information that could lead to you making a hundred thousand to three hundred thousand to five hundred thousand dollars a year. There is no need for a black woman to make five hundred thousand dollars a year because a black woman is going to do absolutely nothing but spend it on herself. Absolutely nothing but spend it on herself. She's not going to support her family. She's not going to buy a house. She's not going to buy a car. She's not, she's not going to buy SUVs, station wagons, vans, family vans. She's not going to do any of that stuff. She's going to spend it on herself. And if you think I'm being some sort of sexist or something like that, women today, married women, keep 99% of their paycheck. Do not pay bills. Do not pay anything for the house. That's women today. So the science is with my statement. There is no need for me to tell black women to do anything to make $500,000 a year because it's going to be a waste of time and a waste of money. Pay attention, black men. Here's the fun fact. When they got computers down to be able to sit on your desk, women actually dominated the field. Not because women are super into computers and nerdy and nothing like that, but because at the time it was one of the most available office jobs. Women like to sit under air conditioner, eat or be comfortable, what have you. And we're talking about data entry. So there was a lot of just grunt work that needed to be done and women were the ones to uh, do it. They dominated the field at the time. Then something changed. Oh, also, some of them did go into computer science and do stuff like that. And they and they did invent stuff in that field. Few and far between, but they did invent stuff. Okay. A feminist is not going to tell you that women dominated the field of computers back in the day. Because that goes against their narrative of women never did anything, blah, blah, blah. It is completely a lie. Shkama is here to tell you women dominated the field at one time. Then, for whatever reason, that all changed. Then, who took over? Black men. Black men dominated the field and they did the data entry and all that sort of stuff at that level, right? Then for whatever reason, all of that went away and I have no idea why. Now it's dominated by just white people. <laughs> uh, what am I about to give you, the information I'm about to give you for free, I'm directing this towards black men. And we're talking about giving you information where after you use it, you could be making a hundred thousand, three hundred thousand or five hundred thousand dollars a year. Why am I directing at black men? Because it's useless to give this to black women because black women will do nothing but use it on themselves and waste their money. And if you think I'm being sexist by saying this, look at the data and the stats, even married women right now, 99% of their income of their salaries goes to them they don't pay any bills they don't pay any house notes they don't pay nothing they keep all of their money that is the science today so me telling a black women to do anything is going to be useless because they're just going to waste the money they're not going to support a family they're not going to take care of anything they they don't even pay child support 99 percent of child support that has been rendered against a woman so the woman is supposed to be child child pay child support goes completely unpaid that is a fact and and police don't chase them no, nobody hunts them down that's all women white black blue green polka dot or whatever they do not pay child support and so the man the single father is on the line to pay all of that themselves so me telling a telling a black woman how to uh get money is useless so here we go black men i'm going to give you a link to a free resource that will give you 800 f absolutely free online courses for computer science and i looked at the list and it is extensive and it has everything I'm giving to you this list where you could be potentially making $500,000 a year for free. I'm getting nothing from this other than you watching this video as are most of my videos. No, all of my videos. And sometimes uh, YouTube comes against me and says, you can't show that video. 
Why? Uh, because you're telling the truth and we don't want you to tell the, tr tell the truth. So here we are. This information, I'm going to leave the link there. I've uh, I've gone ahead and made a uh, shortened link just for this occasion. I'm going to give to you, giving you this for free. Do not just overlook. If you're not making $500,000 a year, don't overlook this and say, well, I ain't got time for that. Oh, I ain't, I ain't clicking on no link. I ain't going to do nothing. And, and please don't do that. And then turn around and say, oh my God, this inflation is just out. I'm giving you a link where you could possibly make $500,000 a year. And I'm not getting anything out of this. Do you hear me? I want black men to dominate the computer field again. And this time I want you to dominate the com computer field in the form of actual computer science and not data entry, which is you typing numbers on a keyboard without even thinking about it, not even using your brain because it's you're so used to it. You don't even have to think about this stuff. I'm a Pan-Africanist. I want to elevate black people to the level of everybody else. If that means all 10 million black men in the United States should be making $500,000 a year, so be it. It's a sacrifice I'm, I'm willing to make. <laughs> now, understand my Pan-Africanism coincides with my libertarianism. I'm talking about equality that you have the potential to make $500,000. Now, I keep saying $500,000. Shikama, how do I make $500,000 using this information? Well, you, you, for the next five years, use all 800 classes, and then you set up a GitHub project, and you make an astounding project, right? And then you make two, and then you make 10, and then you make 20. So then when you go to apply, you can point to those 20 projects and say, hey, look here, this is what I made. This is right here. And it's copy written, copy written to me so nobody can steal it either. And they will be amazed. And that's how, and this information I just said, that information came from a person who got a uh, job at Google doing exactly that. And they asked him, how did you come about to be making $300,000 a year at Google? He says, I did this. I didn't go to school, but then I made the projects and set them online so that everybody could see the projects. And boom, when I go to do the interview, I say, here's a project. It's right on GitHub. There you go. Have a look, have a look, see. And the project is amazing because I spent all, all hours of the day refining it and make sure, making sure it was perfect. There you go. And that's how you get a $500,000 job. And don't think that those $500,000, uh, $500,000 a year jobs aren't available. They are. They are looking for people to fill them. And they are looking for Americans to fill them so that the American can go over to San Francisco, uh, Simi Valley, uh, uh, Silicon Valley, and uh, shake their hand in person and talk to them and come into the office and do the job right then and there. And make, and make sure you can do everything. And guess what? MIT offers, us, it offers free online stuff too all the time. MIT, Harvard, Princeton, free all the time. You just, I don't have the links for that. You just have to go look for it. There's stuff right here on YouTube. You could you could look you could look at the actual. They have the full course right here on YouTube. YouTube. I don't want to hear you talk about inflation, Biden, blah blah blah. Uh, we we should be so above it that Biden, Trump, DeSantis, Hillary Clinton, none of it, it doesn't even matter to us. We'll be making money hand over fist. Thank you all for watching.